Okay, we have a question from Adley. <laughs> One, how strong is strong enough? I train to just be able to move well, perform daily tasks, and lead a healthy life. I don't aim to deadlift a house or bench press a car, but I'm wondering what you think is a good base strength for a male to have. Yeah, it's real simple. Uh, it's I have a, in, If you go to danjohn.net, uh, so type in on Google danjohn.net, sleepless in Seattle and I give you all my strong enough but to save you all that work I think you ought to be able to bench body weight deadlift I think double body weight but you know I I, I that's what I think so I'll just stick with it um, do five pull-ups okay um, I'd love to see you be able to perform a deep goblet squat without any real, you know, it should look okay. I'd love to see you squat body weight. And then uh, an odd one, but I, I found this to be very helpful, is um, it doesn't have to be a Turkish getup, but it, this is what we use. Uh, you get a half a cup, now make sure it's a plastic or a paper cup. Fill a paper cup halfway full of water and do a Turkish getup with the water on the fist. And then when you come back down, switch hands and do it that way. Um, that's been this wonderful test for me that I've used to just double check. And you could, someone can say, well, that's balance. Oh, that's this, that's that. But for me, it really checks overall body mobility. If you can get up and down without baptizing yourself, it tells me that your shoulders, your hips, your knees, your ankles are all doing the jobs that the shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles are supposed to be doing. 